Hey guys, um, I wanted to talk to you about a topic that was in my mind for a while and um, it has been resurfaced by an article that I read in a magazine and um, the magazine is called All You and um, this magazine is sort of a woman's day meets good housekeeping type of thing where um, it has a lot of health health tips in there, um, it has a lot of um, home care tips in there, um, and it also, um, every issue has a lot of coupons that of things that are, you know, regularly used in the house, um, and food as well too, that you can clip off, and it's only two forty nine. so I really love this magazine. Um, and the particular article was called Detox Your Home and it was basically um, giving you uh, clues how to recognize the different chemicals that are potentially harmful to your health um, that are in your products that you use at, you know, regularly at home. And um, what caught my eye was the detoxing the bathroom where um, it mainly talked about, you know, your normal personal care products like your shampoos, your conditioners, lotions, and things like that. Makeup, nail polish, you know. Um, and the two chemicals that I wanted to concentrate on were the parabens and the pathlates. Um, as many as you know, the, um, the, the parabens are used in a lot of the hair care products, which we do see now. A lot of them do say paraben free and things like that. And um, this actually said that one study found that paraben, and I'm, I'm reading off the article, so that's why I might be looking down, but it says one study found parabens in the breast tumors of 18 out of 20 women. I mean, I was like, wow, where, where is this chemical coming from if our body does not produce this chemical, you know, on its own? So it must be coming from uh, things that we use and if for it to have been found in the tumors of 18 out of 20 women the breast tumors uh, that was a scary thought for me you know because it, it makes you wonder whether all these outbursts of cancer um, that have been going on now so you know there there's so many cases of it especially me being in the medical field, I'm very exposed to that, and I mean, it's unbelievable the amount of patients, cancer patients that are out there now, you know, and it makes you wonder if these cancers are, you know, due to things more than genetics, and if we're ingesting all these things into our body, and maybe not eating it, but we're exposing our body to all these chemicals, are we causing these cancers, you know, and to, to grow in our body, you know what I mean? And that was just, uh, you know, I was really, really scared about, you know, that thought, you know. And then about the pa the pathlates, it, that it says it's found in makeup, hairspray, moisturizers, shampoos, and fragrances, and it's is used to allow makeup and lotions to penetrate the skin and it makes nail polish flexible and helps fragrance last longer. And it says you will most likely find it in the ingredients listed as just fragrance. And um, it, if it just says fragrance, the, the um, likelihood of pathlates being present within those fragrances is very um, it's very high so um, they say that you should avoid these uh, products that have um, pathlates because sorry 
sorry <laughs> I'm trying to give you the correct information it says because pathways mimic hormones including estrogen and researchers say they suspect the chemicals affect the onset of puberty in girls and one study linked to high levels of pathways with early breast development and other studies indicate pathways may disrupt hormones in boys prenatally okay um, I, I mean, once again, I, it takes me back to when I was younger. You, you, you know, you, you used to have to wait for your boobies to grow. And now you see all these little girls, eight and nine year old, wearing bras and having bigger boobs than adults do. You know what I mean? So I, I, I totally think that there's a lot of truth um, to all these things about, you know, avoiding chemicals and and all of that and, and it's a really scary thought that um, this might be the cause of all the things that are happening out in the world all the sicknesses and things like that so it's something to think about you know and I just wanted to share this with you guys because I thought it was very very interesting um, this issue is supposed to be out until November 19th so if you wanted to pick it up this is what it looks like okay and then there's a bonus there's $70 in coupons within this uh, magazine so definitely check this out um, research parabens research pathlates and I think it's very worth it to look into things that do not contain these chemicals and um, hopefully lead a healthier life okay so hope you guys enjoy this thanks again for subscribing um, I appreciate all of you that did and um, I hope that many more of you would like to subscribe to my channel and um, we can support each other okay thanks again bye bye